eh, los verbos. En las alabanzas ah, salen sí. los verbos. Good evening, teacher. Hello, Aprecio. everybody. Hello, hello. Thank you very much. How are you? ¿Cómo están todos? How are you doing? Great, great, great. Great. Good to hear. That is awesome. Thank you very much uh, for being here. Uh, okay, I see more people. So I see Beatriz, Victor, Hugo, Mayra, Carolina. I see Miss Romero, mm -hmm. eh, Van, Victor, Jader. I guess it's Jader, Jader. 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 All yeah. right, thank you. Yeah. Hugo, Mr. Mejia. Okay, Mr. Rivas. Thank you guys. Gracias por conectarse. That is awesome. We have a really good at attendance today. All right. ¿Cómo estuvo su día? Did you get wet? ¿Se mojaron? Y hay una que anda enojada porque se mojó. <laughs> okay. Well, es parte del clima, right? So, pero lo importante es que somos salvadoreños and uh, well, nos levantamos. Exactly. Intentamos todo exactly. el día. Salir adelante. So that is the idea. Okay, teacher. Uh, hello, tell me. Juan Carlos diciendo que no iba a haber clases porque Nayib había dicho que no había tenía que tener clases. Oh, we are having clases. Por eso han enojado, por eso han enojado él. Ah, well, oh, yo. Juan Carlos. Ah, oh, yo. Well, I'm sorry about that, but, but anyway, we are going to get started with the class, okay? Les comparto eh, mi pantalla right here. Okay, I'm going to share my screen so you can take a look at algunas de las actividades que vamos a hacer today, all right? And, uh, well, first of all, me, coment me preguntaba ayer Mayra un poquito sobre We Going To, so ya estaba avanzando con parte de la plataforma. And uh, actually, this is the topic that we have for today. We are going to practice, uh, We Going To, talking about future plans Okay, so by the end of the class, you will learn how to sum natural when talking about future plans by reducing going to. Ayer alguien comentaba un poquito de gonna, so también vamos a practicarlo, okay? And we are going to practice, uh, be going to in positive, in negative, and in questions too. This is a very uh, useful topic, so espero que le podamos encontrar la práctica, um, la forma de, de, de utilizarlo, right? First of all, uh, we just be going to, to talk about plans and intentions. Okay, so your goal, your plan. For example, take a look at the question here. What are you going to tell your boss? ¿Qué le vas a contar a tu jefe? What are you going to tell your boss? And the girl here says, I am going to tell him that he is not fair. Le voy a decir a mi jefe que él no es justo con los compañeros, right? So pretty much, esto es un plan, okay? This is an intention, or this is like a plan that you may have. Um, allow me just a second here. Okay, so now let's continue. Let's take a look at this part. Yesterday, veíamos un poquito de going to. So vimos la introducción al tema, right? We checked the introduction to the topic. Um, just regálenme one second here. Solo déjenme um, solventar algo con la conexión a internet. A la vida esta second. Okay, here we go. So let me let me share my screen one more time. Okay, and um, so we use this little. Um, structure, okay, this very important structure to talk about plan. Vamos a hablar un poquito de los planes que tienen. For example, if you take a look at my screen right here, it says, what is this person going to do next year? ¿Qué va a hacer esta persona? What is this person going to do next year? And here, tiene las resolutions. Resolutions son todas las metas del próximo año, okay? So let's take a look at this. We have number one, we have six here, okay? Una forma de usar el futuro es solamente agregar I am going to, o en este caso, digamos que um, esas son las metas de Mr. Perez, okay? So Mr. Perez is going to lose weight. 
Mr. Pérez va a bajar de peso. Mr. Pérez is going to lose weight. Yeah? Number two. Mr. Pérez is going to exercise. Va a hacer ejercicio. Okay? Number three. Mr. Pérez is going to drink more water. Okay? What about number four? Can you help me? ¿Me pueden ayudar con la cuatro? Voluntarios, is there no, a voluntarios? No, sé, no, sé si, no sé si dice que va a dejar de fumar. Exactly. Quit smoking. Como es futuro, ¿cómo lo podemos utilizar? Le vamos a agregar. Mr. Pérez. Mr. Pérez. Going to quit smoking. Very good. Exactly. That is the way. So Mr. Pérez is going to quit the smoking. Va a dejar de fumar. All right. What about number five? Earlier to bed. Acá nos falta el verbo que es go, ¿ok? So, Mr. Pérez is going to go earlier to bed. This is, va a irse más temprano a la cama, all right? So, he's, he is going to go earlier to bed. Take a look at number six. He is going to um, drink less, ¿ok? So, va a tomar menos. And uh, una forma más fácil sería utilizar gonna, ¿ok? Gonna es la reducción de going to. Sí, es un poco más informal, all right, but it is okay. So, en vez de decir, I am going to lose weight, solamente digo, I am going to lose weight. And we are good. Instead of saying, I am going to exercise, I am going to exercise, okay? So, es lo mismo, I am going to, I am going to. Solo uno es un poquito más formal, all right? Going to es un poquito más formal. So, take a look at this person. Um, take a look at the resolution the person has. Vamos a escribir nuestras propias resolutions, okay? So, what are you going to do next year? First of all, repasamos un poquito la estructura. Let's check the structure that we have. Uh, we have I. We have am. Okay. And then we have, regaleme un segundo, solo voy a silenciar sus micrófonos, all right. Okay, there we go. So let's take a look at this. We have I, that is the subject. Then we have verb B, that is right here, verb to be. Then we have going to, all right. Or también lo podemos utilizar como gonna, okay. Y luego the base form of the verb que no sufra ningún cambio, all right? For example, I am going to go to Los Chorros um, in December, okay? I am going to uh, do the laundry on Saturday. Y si yo quiero decir que no voy a hacer algo, solamente le digo not. I am not going to play soccer. I am not going to play the guitar because I cannot do that. I am not going to fight. Yo no voy a pelear, all right? I am not going to fight. Um, no voy a leer. I am not going to read. Y podemos cambiar el sujeto. You can have you. You are not going to see a rainbow. Or he, she, and it. So sería con el verbo, um, con la conjugación de is. So he is not going to play um Tennis, for example, or we are not going to go to work tomorrow. We are not going to tell you what to do. I mean, so solamente vamos siguiendo la estructura, okay? And this is really, really easy to make sentences. So first of all, primero y antes que nada, I will give you like two minutes, okay? Hagamos un par de resolutions para el año 2020, all right? For 2020. Write your goals. ¿Cuáles son sus metas? Which are your goals for 2020? You can follow this, okay? You can follow this structure. Are we okay? Do you have an equation? Preguntas? No, teacher, ni una. Uh, just a question, Liana dice que she cannot hear. Can you hear me? ¿Me logran escuchar? Sí, se oye bien, teacher. Se ah, okay. oye muy bien. Okay, thank you. All right, thank you very much. All 
Okay, so I will give you some minutes, okay? Y escribamos sus metas, your goals for 2020. ¿Qué van a hacer? What are you going to do? Remember that we can say I am going to or I am gonna, okay? Ok, great. So, eh, para quienes nos acaban de acompañar, ok, so we are working with be going to, ok, that is for intentions, plans, and goals. So, right now, en estos momentos, what we are doing is writing a short description of your goals for 2020. So, ¿qué van a hacer? What are you going to do uh, for 2020? Are you going to travel? Are you going to like um, start your own business? Are you going to learn another language? Okay, so you are going to um, write a short description. No sé si lo escribí bien, teacher. I am going to go travel Israel. Uh, that is actually quite fine. Solo tenemos dos verbos. So remember that um, I cannot have two verbs. I am going to travel to Israel is okay. So eliminemos el go, right? We can eliminate ah, okay, that one. Okay. Yep. Okay. Elimino el go y pongo solamente I am going to travel Israel. Yeah, that is okay. To, to Israel. Okay, okay, okay. to. That is okay. That is fine. Do you have an equation? Are we okay? Are we good? Um, you can also write some of the activities de las que no van a hacer, right? So, solo le diríamos, I am not going to, and that is negative. So, that is okay. That is fine. Okay, very good. So, um, are we finished? Tenemos un par. Do you have a couple of them? I guess that we have some, right? So, listen up. What we are going to do is this. Vamos a hacer grupos. We are going to make groups. We are going to practice. If it is possible, no les leamos, okay? But try to just um, create new ones, okay? Uh, say, or share with your classmates, las que ya tienen, the ones that you have, and intentemos hacer otras, try to make other sentences. Try to share with your classmates your goals and intentions for 2020, all right? De ser posible, no les leamos, solo intentemos recordarnos, try to remember, okay? So we are going to make some groups so you can practice um, with your classmate. And here we go in three, two, and one. There we go. Hello, hello. Entremos a los grupos, please. I see Beatriz, Victor, 
I see Mr. Flores. I see also, all right, Mr. Alvarado. Intentemos entrar, uh, entrar a los grupos, please. Try to enter the groups. Hello, Miss. Hello, Jamie. Hello, good evening. How are you? ¿Cómo estamos? How are you doing? Great, that is awesome. Eh, gracias por, por acompañarnos, all right? Thank you very much for um, being here, okay? No le di el día de ayer, me alegra mucho que ahora nos acompañe, okay? And um, right now, el resto de compañeros están trabajando, uh, practicando Be Going To. That is part of a section number one in the platform, okay? So, Miss uh, Jamie, right? So, Miss, la voy a unir a uno de los grupos, okay, para que podamos practicar. So, the idea is to practice as much as possible. Cuénteles a los compañeros de activities that you have planned for 2020, your goals, your uh, 2020 resolutions, okay? So, vamos a compartir tanto como pueda. All right? So, here you go. Entremos al grupo, please. Enter the group. Get in the group. Mm, I am going to study. So, I am not going to work. Oh. No voy a trabajar. Oh. <laughs> I, am, I am going to I am going to going to travel Colombia. Hello, teacher. Hello there. Uh, sí. A ver, teacher, está bien que nos preguntemos. What is this person going to do next year? What are you going to do? Yes. What are you going to do next year? That is a good question. Good, Beatriz. So Maida says that she is going to, she is not going to travel. No, she is not going to work, right? Sí. Okay. <laughs> awesome. That is great. Okay. <laughs> what about the rest? What are you going to do next year? Y allá I'm going to travel Colombia. Voy a oh, ir a Colombia. Very good. Okay, so you are going to travel to Colombia. Very nice. Okay. Girls, what about you? Uh, Carolina, Lia, Beatriz, what are you going to do next year? I'm going to travel to Italy. <laughs> you are going to travel to, to Italy? I am going... To travel Italy. Ah, okay, to Italy. Excellent. That sounds great. To the Pisa Tower, right? <laughs> A la Torre de Pisa. Okay. Carolina, what about you? What are you going to do? Um, I am going to exercise. Ah, okay. So you're going to exercise. Nice. Beatriz, what about you? What are you going to do? I am going to read a book every day. Nice, that sounds great. So maybe you are going to read like 10 books in a year. Well, I really hope you can do that. Okay, so girls, let's continue, okay? Uh, voy a ir con los demás grupos. Continue, you're doing a good job. That is nice. I am, pero también puede ser you are, ¿verdad? y ya me refiero a usted, yo le digo, you are, you are going, 
you are going to to do uh, uh, ¿cómo es el, uh, What is the hello hello? Uh, I'm sorry. What is the question, Victor? Perdón, Tiche, es que me estaba explicando porque no no me pude conectar ah, antes. Ah, antes okay. se me estaba explicando la situación de cómo 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 utilizar el el going to. Oh, thank you, thank you very much. Okay. Thank you. Actually, yeah, I solo escuché un pedacito, right? Okay. Pero, well, actually, but thank you. Sí, pero, let me let me show you. The, si tenemos... Tell me, eh, Alfredo. Ahí está Alfredo. All right. So eh, I believe Victor eh, estaba intentando explicarle esa parte. So thank you, Victor. Thank you very much. So in sí. general. Es bien fácil, right? It is really easy to use it. Cuando hablamos de planes a futuro, when we are talking about plans, intentions, eh, metas, all right, goals, utilizamos esta estructura de acá. It is really easy. So the only thing that we do is to say, I am going to, eso no cambia, all right? So I am going to, um, and then the rest. I am going to play the guitar. I am going to cook. I am going to watch a soccer match. I am going to read a lot. I am going to study English every day. Uh, so, hablamos de los planes, all right? And si es algo que no va a hacer, we use not. Pero la estructura es la misma, all right? I am not going to watch eh, El Señor de los Cielos, for example. Okay, so I am not going to watch it. So here, the only thing that we do is to um, include a not, okay? And then in the rest of them, like in the rest of the activities, so let's tenemos you are going to, he is going to, she is going to, and but the rest is pretty much the same. Going to no cambia, all right? So the one that is going to change is the verb that is right here. A little better, Mr. Flores? Sí, ya, ya. Thank you. Ok, no problem. Pero para, para formular la pregunta. Oh, todavía no hemos pasado a preguntas, ok. Ah, so, no problem, it's ok. So, right now, vamos a trabajar con la pregunta, what are you going to do in 2020? So, ¿qué va a hacer? What are you going to do? Ok. So that is fine. En un par de segundos entramos a preguntas. No se preocupe. Don't worry about it. Okay. So, uh, any other question? Tenemos otra pregunta. Do you have any other? No. No, oh, thank you. Okay. No problem. That is great. Okay. Allow me just a second. Voy a monitorear los demás grupos. All right. Thank you. You're so welcome. TB. Okay. Okay. Así es. No sé si va a seguir haciendo la, la pregunta, Vilmita. Yo creo que estamos bien ahí. Ma, ya entró la teacher a, a supervisarnos. No va a supervisar, vengo a compartir. I come no, to no, share no, with no, you. No, 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 It's no, 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 uh, I going to uh, travel Israel. Okay. I going no no uh, uh, watch TV. Okay. I am not. I am not. I am not. I am not watch the go to no no no. I am go. Okay. Uh, remember watch, this. I, yeah, let's, let's remember not. the structure. Exactly. I am not going to. I am not going to. So repeat it until you get it. I am not going okay. to. I am going to um, watch, watch TV. Okay. Así? I am going to watch TV. Es yo voy a ver. Yes? No. I am okay. going. I am going. No. Not. Okay. I, I am, am not, not. I am not. Watch TV. Okay, uh, Juan Carlos, listen to this. I am not. I am not. I am not going to. I am going not watch TV. Okay, little by little. I am not. I am not. I am not. Going to. 
going to. I am not yeah. going to. I am going to not to. Mm, I am not. Yo no voy a. I am not. I am not going to. Going, going to. to. Exactly. So that is the full structure. Okay. okay. I am not going to watch a movie. I am not going to read. I am not going to uh, travel to Mexico. All right. So I am not going to. All right. Okay. Uh, okay. Are we okay, guys? Do you have any question here? Tenemos alguna pregunta? Do you have any question? No, no, para hacer, no, no, para hacer uh, la pregunta, eh, o sea, cuando no vamos a hacer algo, no sé cómo sería. Sure, eh, no hemos visto preguntas hasta ese segundo. Si me regalan un par de minutitos, eh, vamos a revisarlas, ¿ok? Uh, no vale. worry about it, yeah, it's okay, vale. no problem. Yeah, okay. All right. ok, guys, so voy a eh, compartir con el otro grupo. Re, eh, seguimos practicando, all right, I'll be back in a second. Es, es como uh, vimos los planes de para los fin de semana para el otro Hello. año Hello. Hello. how are you fine thank you. I'm fine thank you great that's really good are you practicing did you practice yeah. practicado yeah. yes 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 perfect so what are your plans for 2020 the the use uh, el going to yeah, exactly. You can be going to, yes. So what are you going to do in 2020? Okay. Ceci, tell me. Uh, teacher, me voy conectando. Ah, oh, okay. Solo Don't estoy worry. escuchando ahorita. Sure, no problem. Estamos practicando be going to, all right. So we are talking okay. about a plans for the future, like I am going to. I am going to travel. I am going to read books. I am going to study another language. Okay, so it's not okay. going to be similar a lo de ayer. Very similar, but la idea is ya no escribirlo, sino solo intentar decirlo, right? Just try to say it. Ah, okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. So it's Thank okay. Uh, no problem. So I will give you one more minute, guys. Eh, sigamos practicando, continue practicing, please. Y en un minuto regresamos. En one minute, uh, vamos a la. Um, a la conferencia principal, all right? Okay. All right. Uh, I'm going to practice uh, play soccer professional. Hello, hello, welcome back. Todavía nos faltan un par que se nos incluyen. All right, there we go. Okay, so I was checking on you, all right. Uh, you were doing a really good job, so that is good. Um, so, estuvieron practicando, so very good job, that is excellent, okay. Now, we are going to just continue with two things. Number one is negative sentences, y vamos a terminar con preguntas, all right. Some of you were asking, about questions. So, permítanme un segundo, ahorita vemos las preguntas, all right? But before doing that, let's take a look at this. It says, uh, the instruction says, the following people don't intend to do the following actions. Make negative sentences uh, using, in, you know, with their future um, intentions, okay? So, ¿cómo hacemos oraciones en negativo? How do we make negative sentences? Solamente digo, I am not going to, y luego el verbo, all right? So, for example, number one says, I sell my car. I want to say, yo no voy a vender mi carro, all right? So, I am not going to sell my car. No voy a venderlo. I am not going to sell my car. So, coming back, volviendo al anterior, coming back to the previous slide, let me show this to you. I am not going to sell my car. So, seguimos la misma estructura, all right? We follow the same. Solamente tengamos cuidado because not tiene que estar acá y el verbo to be es obligatorio, all right? 
So I am not going to sell my car. So take a look at the others, all right? So we have number two, number three, four, and five, okay? So I will give you two more minutes, all right? And uh, hagamos las negativas. Make them negative using be going to. Siempre estamos hablando de be going to, okay? Plans in the future. So I will give you two, three minutes. Write them on your notebook, okay? Y las compartimos en un par de segundos. Uh, I am right here. Si tenemos preguntas, dudas, or something, uh, please let me know. Me indican, please. Or remember that tiene la opción de levantar la mano tú, all right? Tenemos la opción de chat in case you have uh, more questions, okay? So um, I'll be glad uh, to help you with that. Hello, hello. Uh, tell me, Juan Carlos, how can I help you? Eh, perdón, teacher, me equivoqué ahí. Le quería poner eh, y me comí una letra. Y me comí una letra donde dice Celebrate is This year. year. Okay, sí, okay. correcto, me comí una letra. Y perdón, hasta no, ahorita me okay. estoy fijando. No, no problem, but the sentence is okay. So very good job. That is okay. Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay, no problem. Uh, Mr. Juárez, also your sentence is really good. He is not going to help us. Okay, very good. That is okay. Um, solamente no se nos olvide that normally comenzamos con mayúsculas. Okay, so you have to start writing with capital letters. Y debemos de escribirle un puntito, right? We need a period uh, at the end of the sentence. So don't forget that, please. The rest is really good. So tenemos las respuestas. Do we have the answers? Podemos compartirlas. All right, yeah. so intentemos hacerlos, uh, hacerlos juntos, right? So number one is, I am not going to sell my car. No voy a vender mi auto, all right? Take a look at number two. Ya tenemos la respuesta. Thank you, Mr. Juárez. So he is not going to help us. El no nos va a ayudar, okay? 
What about number three? Let's take a look at number three. It says day. ¿Quién tiene la number three? Do you have number three? They are not going to. They are not going to. I'm sorry. Um, to the heather. Okay, they are not going to study harder. Exactly. Ellos no van a estudiar muy duro. They are not going to study harder. Very good. Number four. Anybody else? Alguien más? Do you have number four? No. We not cool dim diamond tonight. Okay, but me le falta algo. We? We, we, we not. We are, we are, we not. are, we are, are not. We are not. not. Exactly. We, we are, are not, not cool. Good. Going to. Going to. Go we, to, do, we do not enter. Cook right. dinner tonight. Tonight. Yeah. Recordemos eh, que vamos a respetar la estructura, okay? So we are not going to cook. All right. So we are not going to cook the uh, dinner tonight. Very nice. That's okay. Number five. Who has number five? I'm. I am not. I'm not going mm -hmm. to celebrate going my to birthday celebrate. this year. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you very much. So I am not going to celebrate my birthday this year. Very good. So that is negative sentences, okay? Cosas que no vamos a hacer, okay? Very good, that is excellent. Now let's just move on to the last part because this is really important, okay? And uh, well, first of all, let's take a look at questions, okay? Questions are really important. So first of all, let's take a look at the questions we have here. WH questions with be going to. Uh, primero, first of all, and before going into this part, vamos a ver las questions de la manera más fácil que podamos, okay? So allow me just a second here. Okay, so let me share my screen, okay? Okay, here we are. First of all, for example, I say, um, Mr. Perez, I like the last name. So let's say Mr. Perez is going to travel to Europe, okay? So imagine that this is um, what Mr. Perez is going to do. Mr. Perez is going to travel to Europe. And I want you to pay a lot of attention here. Como hago una pregunta? If it is a yes, no question. I have is right here, okay? I am going is to Mr. make... Perez? Oh, exactly. This is where to be. So the only thing that we will do is this. Let me copy and I will paste it one more time, okay? Mr. Perez is going to travel to Europe. If this one is a question, I move the order and I will have, is Mr. Perez going to travel to Europe? And this is a question, okay? Very easy. So one more time. For example, I have, you are going to lose weight. Vas a perder peso, right? You are going to lose weight. This is a normal sentence. And I want to make this equation one more time. I come, I copy, I paste. And instead of saying R in this position, I am are going you? to move it exactly to the beginning position. And my question is, are you going to lose weight? Vas a perder peso. Are you going to lose weight? Okay. So imagine that I have this one. Um, you are going to sell your car sorry about this okay are you are going to sell your car okay so i will copy i will paste and instead of saying you are i am going to move it to the beginning okay are you are Verdad? you going to sell the car that's going it to sell you Oh. Yeah, and I will have a question mark right there. And that's a question. Easy, right? Super fácil. It is really, really easy. So the only thing that we do is change the order. But now, what happens if I want to ask questions 
WH questions. This is a yes no question. Is Mr. Perez going to travel to Europe? Yes, he is. Or no, he isn't. Esto es el verbo be, all right? This is verb to be. And that's it. So it is very easy. If I say, are you going to, if I ask, are you going to lose weight? Yes, I am. Yeah, or no, I am not. Okay, this is verb to be. Now, let's take a look at this one. Quiero hacer WH questions. How do we make WH questions? Let's take a look at this one. I have, is Mr. Perez going to travel to Europe? Yo quiero preguntar cuándo, all right? So, cuándo in English is? When. 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 Oh, very good. Wow. When is Mr. Perez home. going to travel when. to when. Europe? Okay. So, solamente se lo agrego here. I will just put it there, okay? Take a look at this one. Are you going to lose weight? And now in this part, yo le puedo incluir cómo vas a perder peso. En cómo in English is how. How. How are you going to lose weight? Cómo vas a perder peso, all right? O puedo preguntar por qué. Why are you going to lose weight, all right? Or cuándo. When are you going to lose weight? Se le so, oye cortado, teacher. Se le oye cortado. Guys, can you hear me? ¿Me logran escuchar? Yeah. Ahorita yes. sí se oye bien, pero yes, sí, sí, okay. Okay. teacher. Oh, all right. Que el inter está fallando. Es para el internet. Probably is, uh, oh, yeah. La zona de Juan Carlos, teacher. Ah, oh, okay, okay. <laughs> well, si me logran escuchar, that is, that is fine. And uh, still, si no podemos guiarnos por la pantalla, right? That is just fine. So take a look at this. We have how, why, and when. So le agregamos la WH at the very beginning. ¿Estamos bien, guys? Are we good? Okay. Very good. Yes, teacher. Preguntas, do you have any question with this? No question. No, teacher. No questions. Okay, excellent. No so question. let's do something. Uh, we have uh, still a couple of minutes here. I am going to leave my screen, all right? And uh, I want you to first write only two examples, okay? Using the following words. What? And using by, all right? And the other one is where? And the other one is travel. So, I want you to write only two questions. Necesito que escriban solo dos preguntas. I want you to use only, uh, to write two questions. La primera using what and by. Y la segunda utilizando where and travel. Okay? So, les voy a dar tres minutos. I'm going to give you like three minutes. Escribamos la pregunta siguiendo esto. Okay? Follow the order, please. WH, luego el verb to be. Luego tenemos el sujeto, then we have the subject. I am going to use a different color for this. No, this is not good. Then we have going to, that we said before, no cambiamos going to, okay. Then tenemos el verbo, then we need the verb right here. So, esa es la estructura. This is the structure. In your sentence, debe de tener todos estos elementos, all right? One, two, three four and five, al menos cinco, at least five. What? Solo dos preguntas. Let's write two questions, please.
¿Cómo vamos? ¿Are we about to finish? Ya casi las tenemos. Ya casi. No sé si estará bien lo que acabo de enviar. Yeah, actually, that is a really good question. Why are you going to visit planes de, de renderos? ¿Por qué, right? Why are you going to visit? Okay. Yeah, it's good. Very good. Gracias. Eh, yes, Juan Carlos. Yo tuve un pequeño problema. Me sacó la plataforma. Yeah, me sacó repente. el internet. No sé por qué fue que me pasó. No sé si mi internet o el... O no sé qué pasó, pero no entendí lo último que puso. Ya, yeah, de repente se me desapareció. Don't worry. So, eh, estamos trabajando con questions, all right? We are working with questions using WH words. So, just a second. So, let me recap, all right? Let me make, um, let me recap this part. So, in questions, this is really easy. Because normally, let me go back. Normally you have, for example, this sentence. Okay, I'm going to eliminate this one. I am going to erase it. Okay. And we have this sentence. Mr. Perez is going to travel to Europe. Okay. So, el va a viajar. He is going to travel to Europe. But now I want to make a question. So, to make questions, you simply going to... It is really easy because this is verb to be. And we know that in a normal question, verb to be switches the order and we use it at the very beginning. So the question is, is Mr. Perez going to travel to Europe? And that's it, okay? But now we can have a more questions. We can we can have, for example, a, ¿cuándo va a viajar? So we can include the WH word, that is when. But el resto de la pregunta, it's exactly the same. So I come, I copy and I paste. When is Mr. Pérez going to travel to Europe? But then I can change it, okay? Instead of using when, I can use other words. For example, I can use por qué, I can use why. But then the rest of my sentence, my I'm sorry, the rest of my question is good. Why is Mr. Perez going to travel to Europe? So if you pay attention, your WH word, your WH equation must have the next. WH word plus verb to be plus the subject, in this case, is Mr. Perez, uh, plus uh, going to, okay, plus the verb, the verb in the base form, we don't change it, we don't modify it, okay, the complement and the question mark. And this is the structure for WH um, questions, okay, and if you pay attention, these questions have all the elements that are needed. Why is the WH word? Is, is verb to be. Mr. Perez is the subject. Then we have going to, then travel, and then to Europe. So tiene todos los elementos, okay? In the chat, I see um, some questions. Allow me o sea, just... que puedo decirle, teacher, puedo decirle, how, how is Mr. Perez going to travel to Europa? To Europe, exactly, exactly, that is correct, that is ¿Cómo fine. ¿Cómo que usted va a viajar a Europa? ¿va? No, no, Mr. Perez, Mr. Sí, Mr. Perez, Perez, right? Sí. Yeah. Pues sí, Mr. Perez, no, no usted, teacher. porque usted no, todavía no va a viajar porque tell no está en clase. Hello, eh, teacher, yes, eh, sería, estaría bien, what are going to buy in the market? Mm, y, well, remember that estamos respetando todos los elementos, so what, what, are, are going to el fatal subject what are are you what are, are you, going, you going to buy in the market are you Ahora going sí. to buy in the market okay. now it sounds fine 
what is the teacher going to, uh, Victor, me le falta algo, something is missing in your sentence. What is the teacher going to, pero no le veo el verbo, so check it out, all right? Um, Mr. Mejia, same thing, me le falta algo. What is uh, going to, me le falta el subject, we are missing the subject there. Uh, Mr. Pineda, same thing, me le falta. It says, what are, and then, by, me le, se me salta hasta acá. Me falta subject, me falta going. Remember, we are going to um, respect the structure because it is easier, all right? Um, so let me see. Where, what is Mr. Perez going to buy, uh, says Mayra. Where is Mr. Perez going to travel? Okay, much better. How are Carlos going to buy a car? Uh, Mr. Juarez, your sentence is quite fine. Pero me le he puesto, how are, y es Carlos. So that would be, how is Carlos going to buy a car? Lo demás, perfect, that is really good. When is Mr. Perez going to study Gracias. English? That is a good one. What are you going to buy in the mall? All right, very good, they are really good. So take a look at these questions, all right? Let's take a look at the first. Number one, guys, we have what and we have buy. So we can ask, what are you going to buy? ¿Qué van a comprar? What are you going to buy in the store? Yes, that is okay. So guys, what are you going to buy in the store? ¿Qué van a comprar en la tienda? What are you going to buy in the store? Let me have some volunteers, okay? So we have Mr. Let me see. Mr. Flores, hello. Mr. Flores, can you hear me? Alfredo? Hello, hello. Oh, hello, there you are, okay, perfect. Okay, no problem. So tell me, Mr. Flores, what are you going to buy next week? Utilizamos la estructura, to, exactly. Perfect. I'm going to buy a new bicycle. Very good, that sounds great. Okay, now another question there is, where are you going to travel in December? Oh, that, I like that question. So, Jamie De Rico, hello. Jamie, oh, there you are. Okay, hello. Tell me, where are you going to travel in December? Where? A donde? Where are you going to travel in December? I am traveling. So you, you're, I'm, I'm sorry, I uh, couldn't hear you. So where are you going to travel? I guess we are having some technical issues. And no, lo, no logro escuchar. Um, a Mrs. Rico, all right? And uh, let's go with, mientras lo solucionamos, with Mr. Alvarado. Victor, hello. Hi, Victor. I'm sorry, I'm going to unmute you. Okay, hello, hello. Tell me, where are you going to travel hello. in December, Victor? Um, no, I'm not traveling in December. Oh, you are not going to travel? I oh. am working very much. Ah, very good. I am going to work. So, yo voy a trabajar. Excellent. That's okay. Okay, just one more question. Uh, let me see. We have Miguel. Tell me, Miguel, what are you going to... Let me see. What are you going to buy tomorrow? Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm going to unmute you. Tell me, Miguel, what are you going to buy tomorrow? Okay. Uh, I, am, I am going uh, to, to, buy, to buy the bread, cereals. Okay. 
Okay, excellent. That sounds great. Okay, so very good. And that is exactly the way we use be going to, okay? Para hablar de planes, all right? Intentions or metas or goals. Antes de irnos, before going um, to bed, you know? So do you have an equation? Preguntas or are we okay? No it's questions. Okay, teacher. No okay. Question. It's, it's... perfect. So everybody, solamente hacerles la atenta invitación, all right? No, Para yo... que... Empezamos. Yo tengo una pregunta. Tell me, tell me, mister. Este, soy nuevo en el grupo y pues todavía vengo de otro grupo. Ah, y okay. estaba viendo que utilizan bastante el chat. El, ¿Por el chat mandamos las respuestas? Um, sometimes, si tiene dudas, utilizamos el chat, right? Si tiene las respuestas, le gustaría compartir algo, you can also share it. Uh, the chat section, porque también de esa manera, um, you know, puedo estarlo monitoreando and I can give you like feedback y puedo hacerle correcciones if you need to. No es reglamentario, right? But it is up to you. If you want to use it, eh, igual, para que todos vayan uh, participando question? y corrigiéndonos. So that is all right. Okay. Yeah, if you have questions, exactly. Okay, that's all right. Eh, levante la mano. All right. Uh, okay. So, thank you very much, guys. Hacerles la atenta invitación too, para que sigamos trabajando en la plataforma, right? So, okay. thank you, everybody. Um, have a really good night, all right? Gracias good por su night. participación. And okay. I'll meet good you night. tomorrow. Have a good night. Good night, miss. Good night. Tomorrow.